Hey everybody, today I want to talk to you about a Ken Sewing Center exclusive, and that is the HD2200. This is our heavy duty model. Janome has done it again. This will be the top of the line machine in the heavy duty series. It has the front loading bobbin system, and we will have a lot of features. There's a lot of stitches and a lot of accessories that comes with this machine. So let's get started giving you a brief overview of the machine. First of all, if you'll notice, we do have two built-in spool pins that are recessed into the machine. We don't want to use both of them, but you can also use this for our twin needle sewing. Or if you want to stage a different uh, thread, you have that extra spool pin there. It does have an easy carrying handle. And another thing I like about this machine, we have had molded and made for it a hard cover. It's made out of the same material that the machine's made out of. So when we're transporting it, the handle comes up through the case and I don't have to worry about bumping into anything. We do have the built-in bobbin winder and I do have channel threading all the way down to my needle and I will have built in a needle threader to thread that needle for me. The machine will have extra high lift under the presser foot. I will have a long feed dog built into the machine to feed that thicker material through. And then when I get to my lighter weight materials, it really comes in handy there to help thread those materials. On the side of the machine, it's hard to see it, I know in the video, but we'll have pictures. There is an adjustable pressure setting. So now I can adjust the amount of pressure being pressed down on my material. And then if I'm working with lighter weight materials, I don't have to worry about pressing that down into my throat space and everything getting all um, jammed up. The machine does have an all metal plate on it and in the plate there are markings so I can get a seam allowance over from uh, my needle. It does have the removable free arm adjustable there and I do have my front loading all metal bobbin case. And notice we will have drop feed. So if I'm quilting or if I want to do a free motion embroidery or free motion stippling onto a quilt or just darn a hole, put on a button. I can drop the feed dogs real easily and then raise them right back up again. The nice thing about the accessory tray on this machine, it is a little bit bigger than most accessory trays. So I do have a slick finish on the front to help glide my fabric across. But if you'll notice, I do have a built-in ruler. And this one is very easy for me to access all of my accessories. Here there's a bobbin winder spindles built in. The accessory try to put extra bobbins of different colors in. And when I've got everything I need, I can just easily close it back up. This machine is real easy to operate. And we have a lettering system that corresponds to the 22 stitches built in on the machine. I do have the reverse here. But if you'll notice, on the stitch selector, I do have letters built in. So this is really good for a beginner uh, all the way up to a seasoned pro of knowing exactly what stitch I have the machine on at any given time. I can adjust the length of each stitch and the width of each stitch. A nice thing too about having a width setting on the machine is I can have my machine on straight stitch and I can move my width button over and then I'm able to move the needle. So if I'm putting in a zipper, putting in piping, putting in cording, if I want to get right close to a rivet, I'm able to do that with this machine and get the needle exactly where I want to so I can sew around that item. On the HD2200, we have a lot of built-in features uh, on the machine. We have our stitch selector, our length setting, our width setting. But on the stitch diagram itself, we have a lot of utility stitches that are built in on this machine. I do have on my first row here, straight stitch. I can move the needle over for putting in zippers and cording and piping and so on. I will have a zigzag, I have elastic stitches, stretch blind hem with a left tack, a standard left tack blind hem, right tack blind hem, blunt end, right tack blind hem, and then we'll have some popular scallop stitches for decorative effect that's built in. Then I can go here and I can adjust my stitch selector and go to the length, get it on the stitch I want, go to SS, which stands for stretch stitch. This will dial up this bottom row of stitches here. So now I can sew two stitches forward and one in reverse on my straight stitch. I do have a double zigzag. It's also known as a rick rack stitch. I have a smocking stitch. Now I get into my surging stitches or my overcasting stitches with a left tack 
and then I have a blanket stitch, and then I have the overhem for doing a, the edge of a garment, let's say, to keep that from unraveling. And then up built into the cam stack are some other decorative stitches that I can use on the machine. And of course we have the reverse. The HD2200 is super easy to thread. I just put the thread on the spool pin and everything is channeled all the way down to the needle. Then when I get to my needle, I don't know about you, the older I get, the more I appreciate a built-in needle threader. And this is super easy, even if you have good eyesight. Really, for a beginner, uh, I highly recommend a machine with a needle threader. We want to keep them in sewing and having a good time, but Again, to us, that does need our uh, bifocals. Here we go. We have that built in. I've threaded the needle. The bobbin case on the HD2200 is super easy to thread. I have it threaded here. Just goes through one slit. We can help you with any of these things over the phone. All I have to do is thread my bobbin case, which is one little slit for the thread to go through, and I insert the bobbin case back into the machine. Now I'm ready to bring my thread up, and I'm about ready to sew. Here's when the HD and the HD2200 comes in handy. Because basically now I can sew heavier materials and not have to worry about, am I going to damage my machine? So here's two ply, four, eight ply of denim. It's not going to be any problem for this machine. You can go all the way up to garment grade leather. And I also can come down to lighter weight material and I don't have to worry about the machine chewing it up because the feed dog system built in is going to grab that material. I'm not going to have to worry about adjusting tensions in between different, you know, from heavy to thick material. That is never a concern with this particular machine. Notice I have extra high lift under my pressure foot so I can get that thicker material up under there and be able to sew it. So I've got my machine set on straight stitch. I'm going to put it on my stitch length. Of course, my width is going to be on zero. And now I'm ready to sew. It just glides through the material. I have an electronic foot control so I can slow the machine down with my foot. And then I get my other material here. I have a reverse. And I went from eight layers of denim through a standard cotton through a stretch material. There's no puckering. Perfect stitching. It went from extreme heavy to extremely lightweight. What more could you ask? Ken Sewing Center has been an authorized Janome dealer for the past 48 years. Again, this machine here is an exclusive model we've had made for us, and we're here to help you with it. We can compare this machine to any other in the Janome line. We want to help you find the machine that's going to be right for you, for your budget, and the type of sewing you're doing. We are here to help you after the sale, so you can call us toll-free anytime. We're here six days a week. I have several educators, other salespeople, and we have technicians here that can help you with any kind of question that you may have. So feel free to call us.